everybody. This is Pastor Susan and welcome to another day of devotions this week as we are focusing on the core value of kindness. How will we be with each other? How can we do unto others as we would have them do unto us? We begin with kindness. You know, scripture tells us that kindness, God, one of the attributes of God is loving kindness and it is steadfast and it is immovable and it is the thing which grounds you and me in our faith in God through Christ Jesus. You know, the word, um, today we're going to be talking about kindness that comes through courage. And it is courageous to express kindness um, and encouragement. And we've talked before about this understanding of uh, encouragement as giving some, you know, giving courage, pouring out courage on another. And, uh, you know, the word encourage comes from the Greek word parakaleo, um, and the word means one called alongside to help. And in scripture, we know that Jesus talks about that the Holy Spirit is that helper that comes to us from God. Um, the Holy Spirit gives us the ability to receive comfort and receive discernment and to receive guidance and strength and courage. And so the question for us is, in, in these hard situations that we might find ourselves, how can we um, be encouragers of one another in kindness as part of the loving kindness that God has expressed to us, how can we encourage others uh, to be the same in their ways of showing up in the world? And I think about encouragement like being like a cheerleader for others. You know, you can do this. And um, so today I want you to think about uh, the relationships that you have as well as the opportunities that will come this day um, as you encounter people you know and you don't know, uh, to be a source of encouragement, not tearing down, but building up and letting people know that you are with them, that you are walking alongside of them to help, and that they have the opportunity to do that for others as well. Uh, today, our, our prayer comes from Psalm 27, 14, um, and I'm going to read that, uh, and then we're going to have the prayer. So the prayer, or the, or the uh, scripture is, wait for the Lord, be strong, and let your heart take courage. Wait for the Lord. And you know, before we ever do a thing, that is what we need to do. We need to pray and wait on God to give us that strength, to give us that feeling, to give the, us that courage so that we can encourage others. Will you pray with me? Loving and gracious God, even as I take a breath in today, I recognize that every single thing that is in my life can be a gift from you as I am aware of your presence with me. And so I pray for all of us today that as we have these moments that we have at work or at school or um, at the grocery store, wherever we might find ourselves, oh God, that you might give us the courage to be an encourager to others and that you might fill us with the help that comes from the Holy Spirit so that we might offer the help you want to give. We love you, God, and we give you our thanks for your love for us. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen and amen.